Hello everyone. So a bitch is stuck in I don't know what the fuck is going on here, but I'm on my way to fucking I ain't even gonna tell you where the fuck I'm at and going to, but what the fuck man, I'm gonna be fucking late. I'm already late. Diosito, que chingo está pasando? Like was there an accident or what the fuck? So I'm like I've been sitting here for like I don't know like six minutes already. Y no se mueve la verga. So, you know what? I was like, I'm gonna take this time to record a video. How? Because who the fuck knows how long it's gonna be until we move for real. I can't fucking believe it. This has never happened before. Is it Trump supporters up in there or something? Nah, just kidding. So, right now that I was driving, I was kind of thinking of what I could talk about in my next video. And I decided to talk about... <clears throat> like obviously the topic is when I started my nail journey right and so I started thinking because a bitch has a bad memory so I really really have to dig deep in this brain to remember certain things of like fucking forever ago and so I was like hmm like how the fuck did I start doing nails like what the fuck did I do you know so when I started doing nails um it started as a part-time. I know this is going to be important for some people because some people be like, girl, I don't got no money to start doing nails or I don't have time or I don't have, um, I don't have nowhere to do nails. So this is why Zule comes in because girl, I was all of the above. And I still made it happen. Okay, Connor. So what the fuck happened? You pass on those carros. <sighs> so how do you call it? Um. So when I started doing nails, I started as a side thing. To be honest, I never really thought I was gonna do nails. I mentioned it in the past that back in the day when I got licensed, nails was not popular. Like you only got nails if you were going to a pinche party. Los quince años, y nomás era el pinche French tip, el cappuccino, or red nails, and like nothing what we get now. At least I didn't know of it. And so I was working my, I was really like a part time at um, after school program that I worked at. So I would go to college because, bitch, yes, I did go to college, even though it doesn't sound like it because soy bien naca. No, it's kidding. Um, I used to go to ELAC, East Los Angeles College, bitch. Yeah, it was a community college, but bitch, that's all I could get into because a hoe did not have the greatest GPA in high school. Mm -hmm. Pero eso es otra pinche historia for an, another time. And so, um, I used to make like $13 an hour, which was pretty good, bitch, because minimum wage was $8. So, the only bad thing was that I only worked four hours. So, in my brain, I was like, you know what? It's like having a full-time job, but part-time, you know? Like, it's like a win-win situation. So, I was going to college in the mornings, and then after that, the program was from 2 to 6. <clears throat> so, it was Monday through Friday, and so I started doing, the, like, nails at my house, and at, at my mom's house, bitch. I would set up my little fucking table, like just those little foldable tables in the front. We had like a little front yard type of thing. And my dad put like a carpa, like all ghetto, ghetto licious and all. But I didn't give a fuck because a bitch wanted to do nails, right? At this point, I already knew I wanted to do it to other people. So, um, I started doing that and people would look at me like, what the fuck is going on here? Like, aquí me van a hacer las uñas? Like, oh my God, you know? And so, um, I found these customers through, like, Facebook or me passing on my fucking business card because a bitch has been having business cards since I was, like, a legit business, all right? Well, what I considered a legit business was girl is licensed and that's it, you know? But no, girl, you need a business license to be doing work, like, conducting business which i did not know so that is why i'm here to tell you so anyway i was doing ooh, ooh, ya está moviendo. um so i was doing nails Take from my answer. mom's Thank bitch you shut the fuck up i know where i'm going already 
So how did call it? I started doing nails from in in front of my mom's house because first of all, I don't want no random ass bitch coming into my mom's house. Second of all, my mom wouldn't want no random ass bitch coming into her house. And third of all, I don't know where you've been. No, just kidding. My mom didn't like the fucking chemicals. Me mandan a la verga. But you know what? A bitch wanted to do nails, so pa fuera, pa fuera me iba. It was low key embarrassing because I wait, just don't moment. It was kind of embarrassing at first because fuck, this shit's falling. Because so the little carpa that my dad had obviously didn't cover like all around the sides, just the top part. So at a certain time of the day, we had to be moving the little chair and the table porque nos iba a pegar el pinche sol. And so <clears throat> I would tell my customer like, oh, we gotta move now porque pues ya cala el sol, right? And so they obviously never fucking came back <laughs> because the situation was kind of cray cray. Ay, 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 se van a caer. So most of them didn't come back. They just came once. Yeah, and I was like all there, but I like, they didn't like my work or whatever. And plus, my work was not all that good. Mm -mm. I looked back at it and it was ugly girl it was ugly which is totally fine because we all start from ugly majority of us who didn't really have an education because in cosmota in manicure school they fucking teach you almost nothing very little just the basics and so you have to learn on your own right so this is this was before i actually took like classes to learn a little bit more um but yeah, I was like, my nails are cute. I used to charge like $15 for nails. $15 to $30 was like my max. Like I could bedazzle you for like 30 bucks, bitch. That's how low my prices were, which is what I felt let people want to try me, you know, like people would be willing to try me. Be like, okay, pues vamos con esta morra. Además, nada más cobra 30 dólares. O si nos, si nos chingan las pinches uñas, pues ya que no son 30 dólares, ¿verdad? And so, <clears throat> um, I did nails on Friday, sometimes the weekend after I came out of work. I'm sorry if I'm sideways, but se me está cayendo la chingadera. Um, so I did it mainly on the weekends and I started seeing like, you know what? I make almost the same amount of money that I do in my regular job during the weekend on month because I was part-time obviously in my job. Back then I didn't really make a lot of money. Um, I wanna say my monthly income was probably like, mm, I don't know, like $500, $500 I was at after taxes or whatever. I can't remember, but it was very little. Like, como vergas vivía, you know? But times have changed. That was enough back then. Um, so I would make like $500 in the weekend, and bitch, yo me tardaba horas con una clienta, horas. Once, I fucking was doing this girl's name, um, fuck, I mean, her nails. Shout out, Brenda, be watching, girl. So this bitch, I don't know where she found me from, but she asked me for long ass fucking nails and I was like girl and she's like cuanto and every fucking nail was different right so I was like uh, uh 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 girl I don't fucking know like I wasn't good at pricing at that point but to me it was a lot of work but I was done for it you know cause a bitch just wanted to do some nails so then I was like, um, 65, yo en mi cabeza, I was like, fuck, that's a lot of money, like, how am I gonna charge you $65, but they're fucking long, and they all have bling, and 3D, and all this bullshit, and so I was like, you know what, fuck it, 65, no, hombre, esas pinches uñas duré como 6, 7 horas haciéndole las uñas, if not 8 hours, nos llegó la pinche medianoche, y su mamá casi se la chinga, <laughs> she was like, what the fuck? Like, she was like, what the fuck is taking so long? But, yeah, it was kind of funny. Okay, well, I, I already got here, so I'm going to have to continue this.